Hello everybody, it's Emily. I'm a featured Olympus Pro Photographer and uh, if you are new to my channel, feel free to uh, browse around. If uh, you already subscribed, thank you so much. That helped grow my channel and so I really appreciate it. So for today's video, I thought I would talk about gear and more specifically what I use to carry my camera on my daily walks. And uh, I really evolved throughout the years and I've tried different systems and to me the system that I want to show you right now, it's, uh, it's what works the best for me. And spoiler alert, it's not just one system, it's a combination of two systems. So let's not wait too long because it is really, really cold right now in New Hampshire. Uh, uh, and I'm going to show you uh, right away what I'm using. So at the heart of this system is the Think Tank Slim Belt V3. It is super, super light. It's 0 0.38 pounds. Uh, I think the equivalence in kilogram is 0 0.17. So really, really light, really compact. You can just wrap it around, put it in your luggage when you travel. And to me, that's, that's great. I like to have something that's flexible, light, very, very compact. So the belt will come on its own when you buy it. And uh, if you want to add uh, components to it, you will have to buy them individually. But I like that because um, we all have different system uh, that we are carrying with us. And from one day to another, I might need different components with me on my hike. So I like that I can have a flexible system around me. So the elements uh, I bought and I have right now with me on this walk, the first one is the camera clip adapter, V3 model. It's super nice, it's very, very well padded. And uh, I like to have all my camera gear accessible. So um, I use the uh, Peak Design clip. Remember I told you that it's a mix of two brands to make the perfect system for me. So the Peak Design camera clip on, uh, the, on this really nice, padded surface. I really like it and uh, it's actually really really comfortable. Think Tank and Peak Design are really two brands that I recommend. I'm not affiliated with them in any ways. I just love their product uh, because they're very well thought of and very well made. So this system is actually really really comfortable. You can see my 150 to 400 sit nicely on this padded surface right here and um, it's actually not heavy at all. I've done like a two hour walk and without any problems. Um, so very very uh, nice and then if I want to access my camera I just clip and here, here it is out and then I put it back so very very simple simple is key and then if i turn things around uh, i have the ru first tea and uh, that's to carry my water always stay hydrated when you're on a walk it's very well designed you have a little oops, zip here and um, you have a um, raincoat if it rains you can put your water but you can also you have little pockets so you can add extra thing uh, near your water bottle um, maybe if i have a smaller lens cap i can also put it in and sometimes if i go on a very small walk and i really don't think i'm going to need water or if someone else is carrying the water for me uh, i might uh, add one or two lenses in this it's an option it's not made for it but you know you can do it I have a little padded bag and I put my lens in it and then in the RU First T uh, component and it works pretty well. And now the way the system works is um, this can slide around if you want that component uh, so I can place it where I want but there are little hoops on the belt and um, I'll show you with the RU First T. If you take your RU First T, you see you have Velcro, but you also have uh, a little plastic thing. With this plastic thing, you can actually put it through the loops. And if you put it through the loops, uh, then it makes it fixed. So you have two ways of carrying it. 
If you want it to be able to go around your waist, then don't use the plastic, just uh, use the Velcro and you'll be fine. Now, for the second part of my system, uh, I need a little bit more space, I need a bag. I've tried multiple fanny pack. I don't like to uh, wear a bag if I don't have to, a backpack, because I have really bag neck and back shoulder, and I try to not put too much pressure on them. So I like to carry everything around my waist. I've tried so many different um, system and the peak design was really my go-to and the one that I ended up with because I like how slim it is. I don't need more space. I've tried bags that were enormous and then I just, it was a little bit too much. So here it's very, very simple. Uh, you have loops here if you want to put even a tripod. Right now my tripod, I'm using it to uh, uh, make a, you know, this video, but you can put your tripod here. Uh, you have one uh, pocket here for maybe your business card, for uh, filters. What I also like is that I can carry two to three lenses if they are small. So I have my macro lens, uh, I have maybe the 12 millimeter lens that I would have with me, and I have actually the EM1 Mark III with the 12 to 100 millimeter and it all fits in this. It also uh, has a little pocket on the side and I can uh, add you know some cloth to make sure that um, my camera is clean. I also have some space uh, for a blower to also make sure my camera is clean and I have a little uh, pocket here on the side for my batteries for um, extra SD card so it's a very very well thought of bag. There is also a pocket, a pocket uh, where you can uh, slide an iPad but honestly I cannot slide an iPad uh, with the way I pack my bag. It would be a little bit too much and plus it would be a, a little too heavy. So, And with uh, the way that I attached it there is actually a, um, a kind of way here that uh, you can uh, Put your belt if you don't use it as a sling bag so right now for example this I could uh, uh, get out from the internal pocket where I also have the belt going through so you can actually do that it's a little bit you know uh, much to put both the peak design and the belt in but it's totally possible uh, that's usually how I carry it but if I want to have um, you know less weight on my hip and maybe I'm fine holding uh, with a little bit more of my shoulder, then you can definitely uh, untie both and then have an extra strap here. As I said, I don't do this because I don't like to have things on my shoulder. So now let me tell you in five points why I think this system is the best. And I should say this system is the best for my style of photography. Uh, maybe it will be good for your style of photography, I hope. And if not, just tell me uh, in the comment below what are you using and why. I love to, uh, to see what everybody is using. And let's, uh, let's get a discussion going and, and share all our system and help each other. So number one, my system is really, really light. So for me, having a system that's light is key. Uh, and this belt and the peak design is light, it's compact, so it fits the bill for me. Number two, I like to have everything accessible here. Uh, you know, my water bottle is here, my camera is here, my extra gear, uh, everything is accessible. I can just like flip, uh, I can just click and I have my camera in my hand. I'm not going to miss a shot because I was too slow uh, taking my uh, backpack and then digging for my gear. Um, so that's the best system for me. Number three, I told you I have a really, really bad back and also neck. So I don't want things to... Uh, um, to jeopardize my health and that's why carrying on my hip is a better system for me. And you can see here I have this but it's more a security with my uh, 150 to 200 and my EM1X. So it's, uh, uh, it's my hip who is really doing the most of the work and just in case I have this. But um, it's the best system for me and for my health.
Number four, I really, really like uh, how the system is modular. And depending on type of photography I'm doing and the condition, uh, I might want to take a different lens or I might not uh, take my 150-400 and just concentrate on macro so uh, I can uh, put my small uh, macro lens and you know use the uh, camera clip and then my bag will only fit uh, anything that I need for my macro photography from diffuser to flash and number five I think this system actually looks pretty good, you know. Um, the belt, that's maybe not something that I would wear when I go out. I mean, when I say go out, I don't go out because of, uh, <laughs> of the pandemic. But um, I could definitely uh, go out with uh, my camera bag. You know, the peak design is really, really nice. And I've actually used it uh, to put just uh, my camera with like the 12 millimeter lens. Uh, and then I add uh, my, um, my iPad or I add a couple of notebooks and I go out in the world and it's completely fine. It doesn't look like a camera bag, which I really, really like. And uh, so it fits a different purpose than just a camera bag so extra point for this so i hope this video was informative and uh, i can hear some birds tweeting and it might be time for me to go and find them and take a couple of photos um, i cannot wait to see what you guys are using as a carrying system and i will see you next week bye guys